When does one college football game yep. equal three NFL games? Uh, that would be when it's Texas and Texas A&M, and the Aggies are determined to ruin the Longhorns' BCS title bid. They are, after all, the boys who show the real old fight. There's Colt McCoy, 43-7 and seven as a starter. Gerard Johnson, A&M quarterback, 9-12 and 12 career record, but he is awesome. Uh, wait till you see this kid play. Third play of the game, here's Johnson up top, deep downfield. Jeff Fuller is there. Uh, we got a blown coverage. What we have is 70 yards and a touchdown for the Aggies. Kiss your girl, 7 0. Uh, Johnson, one touchdown. McCoy, zero. Well, let's change that. There's his roommate, Jordan Shipley. And now we're even at seven on the scoreboard and on the quarterback touchdown counter, 1 1. Early second quarter. Still tied, third and two. McCoy up the middle, hits the hole, and now he's running like people are chasing him. 65 yards, longest run of the senior's career. It's 14 7. McCoy, 2 1, QB lead. Back come the Aggies. Giggum, Johnson, Fuller again. Crazy eight. We're tied at 14 and two apiece. All right, where's my boy McCoy? Jordan Shipley again. The eights have it. 21 14, Texas. And you know what? It's just starting to get good down there at Kyle Field and College Station. After Shipley muffs a punt, Johnson's turn, Howard Morrow, TD A&M. First half winding down, it's 21 all. Texas trying to score before the break. McCoy, James Kirkendall, they score four seconds. We get the ball to start the second half. It's key to get some points there. And we've got to slow their guy down and keep our guy hot. All right, well, hopefully intermission didn't cool anybody off. Third quarter, Texas leads 35-21. Here comes Johnson. Rolling, scrambling. You saw it second and 14. I believe we have a first down and more. 43 yards on this run. The Ags within scoring distance later on the drive. Johnson, third and five, throws it. This time, that was his bad pass of the night. Earl Thomas gets it. He's on the wrong team. Horns take over on the turnover. Could not capitalize. Fourth quarter now, Aggies down 35-24. Kristen Michael, right side, spin move, touchdown. Aggies within five. Let's go for two, make this a field goal game. Mike Sherman, solid call. Ryan Tannehill, he's got it easily. And it's 35-32. Texas trying to complete that undefeated season, get themselves to 12-0 before they head off to the Big 12 title game. Kirkendall here breaks a tackle. He's going to go 47 yards. And now our touchdown counter, which we haven't uh, looked at here in a moment, 5-3 in favor of McCoy. He's trying to win the Heisman on national television on a Thursday night. AM responds. Fuller one more time. Aggies cut the lead to three again. McCoy five TDs. Johnson four. We're over the 80 point, Mike, combined. Ensuing kickoff. Marquise Goodwin takes it, and there goes the good feeling that the whole core cadets had in this baby. Off he goes, 95 yards on touch. Texas now back up 10, 49 39. Three minutes to go. Randy Bullock on from 23 yards out, get it back to a one score game. Never mind the Bullock. He misses the kick. Oh, he can't. Well, disappointment in Aggie land. Mac Brown, on the other hand, uh, a giant sigh of relief. 49 39 is your final. Colt McCoy throws for 300, runs for a career best 175. Thursday, the 116th meeting between Texas and AM, making it tied for the third most played rivalry in uh, bowl subdivision history. That's along with Minnesota, Wisconsin, Kansas, Missouri. But this game has never seen as many points as it did this Thanksgiving, and they combined for 88 points. UT had 49 of them.